Now we're back to CapCut. Let me show an easy stroke effect. You can apply this to humans. It's a common effect when people dance, for example, in music videos. We use this clip. By the way, I use the default layout. And then I'll go to effects. We want to have the body effects opened. Left click on it and there should be a drop down. It might take some time to get loaded when you've never used it. Then we'll use the stroke and you should search for the cutout effect, cutout poster. Drag and drop it onto your clip. And then you can adjust it right here. Size, adjust the size of the stroke. The last slider is for the color of the stroke. Texture is watch the model. So it gets a little bit like a comic texture when you put it to the max and it preserves the original when you go to the lower values. Filters adjusts the color of the model and strength is important as it gets rid of the background. Let us add a background. I use this image. It's below the dancing model. Now you can't see it. I'll activate the model, so I left click on it in the timeline. Then under Video Basic, you will find the effects and there's the cutout post. So I click on the edit icon. And now if I go down with strength, we've gotten rid of the background. The speed is for the speed of the animation. If you want to have it as smooth as possible, just crank it up to the max 100. The lower you go, the more stop motion it gets. You want to have a different color, maybe this one. And this is all there is. So this is how easy you can add this stroke effect in CapCut. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.